quick to Renex snack. We're live. It's too short to be serious. It has been a while, a hot minute since I've done a Rita's review. I swear, it's about every like two, three weeks that they're like, okay, new something, new this, new that, new that, new that. We're moving on from this. I just don't know how that's a sustainable strategy. Maybe that's why you have so many of them closed like they do and some of them are just seasonal like they'll be open in the summer it's because they just can't keep up with what corporate puts out like you know there's just so much that they're like it's not worth keeping this open and, you know a we're slower during this time of the year and b you know if they're gonna keep pulling this you know it's and that's why it stopped doing reviews because by the time I got around to doing it, because a lot of places I, you know, I throw on the back burner, if they're not like a big A list chain, I put it on the back burner. By the time I get to Rita's, the stuff is gone. So it's, it's just pitiful, it's pointless. So I'm gonna try and get this up before St. Patrick's Day. Um, they didn't really blend this together like they usually do. Usually it's perfectly blended, but we, it's they've got shamrock ice and then they've got Oreo cookie pieces. So it's pretty much like a, a mint Oreo concrete type, type of thing, but it's a blendini because they use the ice and they blend it with their, con, their uh, custard slash ice cream. So you, you get the picture. Now, usually it's perfectly blended, but this they did not perfectly blend which i'm completely fine because when i was in the drive-through in my mind i was like you know i kind of wish I, you know maybe i should have just gotten the um they got one with just the ice unblended and then ice cream i forget what it's called but i was like maybe i should have gotten that because i kind of really want to know what the ice is like like what it tastes like like what it's like to have mint ice shaved ice so i got lucky here um because they didn't blend it perfectly so we do have some mint shaved ice so i get a little bit of a pinch here to talk about before i jump into the rest of the treat so yeah if you have not already subscribed please hit that subscribe button check out my instagram redneck snack oh and please get this video out there by like commenting and sharing it so here it is. See, it doesn't look perfect, but that's fine. I warned you. All right. So first thing I want to do is try this ice. I want it. I want that ice bad. So there, there it is. Look at that. Look at that ice. All right. Hmm. It's like a vanilla mint. Hmm. So it's not quite minty like I was thinking it would be. Like it's in there, but you mainly get this really sweet, kind of off-putting because you're expecting mint. This really sweet kind of Reminds me of snow cream to, to a point. So that's interesting. Let's see how it tastes mixed up with the custard, though. That's the whole huge thing here. It's windy out, by the way. So... If you can feel my car shaking or you can hear it. You can't really feel it, I guess, but that's why. I don't know how I feel. It's got chocolate chips in it too, by the way. Okay, I'm getting a lot more mint. Man, that kind of rocks me with some chills here. Mm. 
Hmm. I, never, I don't remember the last Blendini being this complicated. I thought it was finely mixed. This is kind of giving me some trouble. Like, I like the flavor more than that PDQ shake I had, but the texture is just odd. Don't get me wrong, it's enjoyable, and it's something different. But is it something I particularly love? No. I give it like a, mm, it's complicated. I have to probably say it's a six and a half. Cause I wouldn't say it's, the flavor is just decent. Cause when I do a six, it's usually just decent. I think the flavor is good. It's just the, the complicated texture. It's kind of off-putting here. Which I've had these kinds of issues with readers, which is kind of a part of the reason what steers me away. is like, does it really stand out? Or am I really going to love this? And I come out of this just feeling okay. A little disappointed, but... Yeah. You know. Anyways, that's my reader's review. It might be a while till we get back here unless someone recommends it. But this is their uh, Blendini with the Shamrock Ice, which I guess is supposed to be mint. It has some mint flavor. But alone, the ice just feels weird. Anyways, that's my review. I'm sticking to it. And I will see y'all around. Yeah, yeah, yeah.